Hey everybody, welcome to another Dokkan battle video. I've had some requests from people to try and beat the LR dungeons without nuking. Uh, so for this video we're going to be trying to take down LR Brawly. So, since we're not nuking, our team is going to be based around trying to negate his rampage. So to do so, we need to pick a bunch of the units that have the links, either the complete passive link or needing to be linked up with other units to negate the rampage. So for this, we have pretty much almost the entire Brawly group. And then originally, we were gonna have Super Saiyan 3 Goku as a hitter but we ran into situations where it was hard to block so we replaced them with well, Super Saiyan 2 Goku in order to be able to block and the fact that he gets uh, supers pretty easily so let's go ahead and go into this and try and see how this works out Now one of the issues we're going to run into is that um, I could have used the LR Goku, the newest one uh, that you get from the Hatchiak event, but unfortunately I would have had to drop uh, the Brawly Batch Goku if I did that. So instead, we're going to go with this. And you can see my health has a significant boost more than normal, and that's because of the double Goku lead. Okay, that's the one we wanted right there. So what I'm going to do is try to set up some blues. I should have actually had that red available. Okay, so what's great about this is that definitely getting Gohan super. It doesn't look like it's going to be enough for anybody else's. Maybe enough? Just enough. Like, I've pulled so many of the Brawly Batch trunks that my trunks is actually kind of decent. He has a level 10 super. passive did not kick in. That sucks. So instead of attacking with him, we're gonna just like hold off and save the blues. I was hoping to get him down one life bar for my three free attacks, but it doesn't look like that's going to happen.
Okay, this should probably take him down at least to the second life bar. So as you can see now, we still have a lot of blues, but trying to link them together is going to be an issue. <clears throat> Perfect. Okay. In his own right, Goku actually does hit pretty hard, but we're focusing more on Gohan for this. And this little break that it does in between his attacks is really nice to try to allow you time to try to set up for the next round. Unfortunately, doesn't look like we have enough to try to set up a super. <clears throat> Do have a s eight for next round. So if he's matched up with Goku, I might have enough to do another super. So we're going to sacrifice that there, but that leaves an 8 for next round. Okay, so this should definitely give him a super. switch that up. Well, does his attack go down? His attack really went down. But this should be able to knock him down to the last life bar. So right now we're on a pretty good pace. Really haven't had to use too many items. This is the real danger point though. We're gonna have to go with this to make sure we don't have to eat a super. Because even with the 
Rampage Nullification, it's still gonna be massive damage. So at the same time we're trying to see if there's a way we can set up a super. Because if you look at the wheel, the next group up will have Gohan in it. See, even if we gave her that, that wouldn't be a super. So instead, we might be able to set up greens. So we're going to go with this, and that'll set up a nice group of green. Possibly he could get a super out of that. Okay, so he needs a 7. This is only 6. So that's not going to work. So let's do that. And that's still 6. Uh, we might not get a super out of this. Well, then again, we do have the panties. Now this is a reminder, the panties only give full meter during the anniversary events. So I think they go on until the 15th. Once the anniversary is over, they will not be 100% meter anymore. I'm not sure what it's going to end up being. I still think they're going to be pretty good, but I just don't know exactly how, how much meter it's going to be. Oh, I still have one more. Let's go with that. Also, if you're watching this video, then you should know that the Big Ass Hope Monkey card is available. That, of course, being the humorously, humorously translated Spirit Bomb Goku card. That was part of the anniversary Twitter campaign. Uh, it's available now, so if you go to your gift box, it should be sitting there waiting on you. Uh, if you happen to have the other Spirit Bomb Goku, unfortunately, that one cannot be teamed up with the new one. So that kind of sucks, but it's alright. Okay, so here's the team attack one. I think I have the right block though. Like the first one is the super important one. So the first one should be Trunks. He blocks the majority of it. So even though the others are not strong elements, they don't take as much damage. And then tomorrow, or the 4th in Japan, there's supposed to be a 4 hour maintenance. <clears throat> hopefully, well, not really hopefully, more than likely it's because it's all the uh, Janemba event. What I'm hoping for is that the events will be active immediately, so that I can stream it. 
on Wednesday. At least that's my hope. We'll see what happens. So we're in the final stretch here. Getting real close here. We'll probably have to do one more round. And of course they're going to give him first attack. We'll switch this up actually. I have a feeling he's not going to get past trunks, but just in case he does, Gohan will finish him off. So he's going to do a super. Trunk should be able to block most of it. Should be about 20. Yeah, 21. It's because it's strong element and he has the rampage nullification. Like if I was going to try to block the super with like the Super Saiyan 2 Goku that does not have rampage nullification, he still would have ate like almost fatal damage from that. So, that's how you beat that dungeon. You really need to have the units that have the Rampage Nullification. That is super important. Uh, I would say the next important thing to have is the Brawly Batch Gohan. He's the one that's going to be doing the most damage to Brawly in this event. So you really need to look for those two cards. Uh, if you don't have the Brawly Batch Gohan, Try to find a friend that has him because it, that it's really super important. I think to have him as your hitter, and then most people that were pulling during the Brawly Batch had at least one Trunks. You know, this is the time he shines. This is the time he's perfect for an event. So that's it. So thanks everybody for watching this video. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to do so below. Uh, I will be streaming tomorrow, Wednesday, hopefully for the new Janemba events. And later on, I'll try to do the Cell event as well. Although that one is significantly more difficult than the Brawly Batch, than the Brawly Dungeon is. But that's for another day. So thank you all for watching and we will see you next time.